The one thing that I wish everybody knew about digital health is that you have to be persistent. If it was easy, everyone would do it. But nothing is easy when you're trying to transform the way that people look at new technologies, especially in healthcare. My name is Manuel Montalvo. My job here at Teva is to really bring a blend of technology and healthcare expertise to try to provide better outcomes for patients. The three trends right now that we're currently looking at at Teva are one, predictive care, two, personalized healthcare, and the third one is the datification, all this information that we're gathering through smart devices. Predictive care is very much at a crossroads where we have a lot of smart devices, smart watches, smart scales, smart inhalers. And as you think about predictive care, you're using artificial intelligence to try to prevent uh, an attack from happening and using all this information to give the patient a better way of managing their disease. The second trend we're following is about personalized care. Personalized care, if you think about all these smart devices that are available today, they capture where you are, they capture what time you took the medication, they capture what time of day it is, whether it's raining outside, whether it's a sunny day, whether there's pollution, and all of that can be customized to really give you the care you need. So for example, if you're going on a run, the smart device may actually ping you on your smartphone and let you know that you need to take your medication because the conditions outside aren't really ideal for your running. Oh, and or if you are gonna run, these are the medications you may need to, to fulfill that run. The third trend we're following at Teva is this, what we call datafication. With all of these smart uh, components that we're, what, that we're using today, you have all these data points that are sent and we capture them through our cloud services. With all these data points, we now begin to think about what can we do with all that data? Can we target it personally and, and deliver it into the uh, patient's hands? Or can we use it into the hospital system? So all of this datafication now is beginning to really emerge. And with smart intelligence and artificial intelligence and machine learning, we're able to dissect that data in a much more profound way than we've ever had in our, in our industry.